Purpose is that feeling that you are a part of something bigger than yourself, that you are needed, and that you have something better ahead to work for. Purpose is what creates true happiness. The key with me is just always finding what the anchor is. And the fucking anchor is getting up at four o'clock in the morning every day before anybody else and grounding my thought process is in the no one will outwork me. No one. Work like hell. I mean, you just have to put in, you know, 80 hour, 80 to 100 hour weeks every week. If you think that you're gonna go and accomplish something really special and be the best in anything in the world, and you think you can do it without working, you make a big mistake. Because no matter what I did, if it was in bodybuilding or in acting or if it is in, in, in the political arena, uh, it always took a lot, a lot of work. Nobody you know has become successful outside of it being given to them from their family. Nobody you know has actually created success without working their face off. It doesn't exist. You gotta have the mentality to show up every fucking day of your life. No matter what life throws at you. It's our responsibility to show up to the Coliseum of life. Prepare for fucking battle. I don't care what you're going through, what life's throwing at you. It's your responsibility to find your new 100%. Where I excel is ridiculous, sickening work ethic. You know, while the other guy's sleeping, I'm working. While the other guy's eating, I'm working. Ease is a greater threat to progress than hardship. When I was your age, I could work four or five days in a row with no sleep. Go out for a 10 mile run and come back and work another day. But the difference is I loved everything that I've ever done, looking back in hindsight, I absolutely adored, I had great passion for it. Because if you don't have great passion for it, it gets old quickly. Work hard like, in, in, I mean, every waking hour. That's, that's the, the thing I would, I would say, if, if you, particularly if you're starting a company. Um, and I mean, if you do simple math, say like, okay, if somebody else is working 50 hours and you're working 100, uh, you'll get twice as done as much done in the course of a year as, the, as uh, the other company. So every day, my back is up against this motherfucker, and this is how I operate. Now, doesn't mean you don't smile, doesn't mean you don't laugh and joke, quote, right? You're happy, I'm happy, I'm a happy guy. But when it comes to business, and when it comes to executing, it's up against this. And I gotta go that way. And I don't give a fuck who is in front of me. They're not going to stop me. The hardest thing to do is start. Um, you have all these ideas, and everyone has an idea, but it's really about executing the idea and building the idea and attracting other people to help you work on the idea. That is the biggest challenge. What I've realized over the 23 years of my life, it's not the physical body that holds us back. It's not the physical body that holds us back, but it's the mindset. The biggest disability you can have is a bad mindset. It's not this. We are handicapped. We are crippled by our limiting beliefs.